So we're first doing is we're going on a blue trail called Disco Tech in the Discovery Zone. Then we're gonna go up to the top of the mountain, do off the top, into Kamikaze, into Richter. So yeah, should be pretty fun. Almost at the top. What's nice during quarantine is there's no lift lines. Yep, tell me how you guys like the chin mount in the comment section below. So right when you get off the lift, it's right to the left is Disco Tech. And you got Richter right there, which is a black diamond. What you're gonna do next run after we come off from the very top. <sighs> Manual fuel the rollers. <sighs> Super loose here. I don't know if I'll ever get completely used to it. Little drop thing. Take these bigger drops. Still not very big. This is pretty easy. It's really good. Warm up. I forgot to take my mask off, so that's why my voice sounds kind of muffled. Take these bones. Nice and easy. Okay, yep, that's Disco Tech. See, so yeah, we're taking the gondola up to the top. Take off the top down, which is a blue trail. It's pretty fun. Yesterday we did it and had 60 mile an hour winds, so that wasn't great. Then we're gonna connect into Kamikaze, into Richter. So now we at the top. Those stairs are evenly spaced with my wheel, and that felt really odd. All right, so now we're gonna go hit off the top. It's a little bit of a win, but not much. Purposely gonna fall back a little bit so I don't get dusted in the face the whole time. Should probably fall back a little bit more. Too loose here. This is literally just like riding on sand. It's really deep too, so the front end starts squirming a little bit. Uh, that went into a giant pile of dust. I didn't want to take that jump. This is really not much to look at on video, so I'll probably just meet you at Kamikaze. Kamikaze is not much to look at on video either, though. It's just basically super loose, super steep file road. jumps you can do. Still kind of a warm up. It's so hard to just stay focused on the trail when there's such a good view. Holy cow. Foot out and loose right next to a cliff so I don't want to fall out. But dude the view There's a couple cool rock garden sections on this trail, but other than that, it's mostly just loose and flowy. Couple little of those drops. Uh, yeah, I'll get back to you once we get to Kamikaze. All right, so those off the top, there's Gravy Train. And we go to the left of Gravy Train. That's how we get to hook into Kamikaze. Okay, right, so now we're gonna go hit Kamikaze. I've never done it before, my dad has. So it's basically just a really loose, straight down fire road. Kamikaze is super fast. Holy cow, I forgot already. Jeez, it's... Oh, your front end just squirms, it's so loose. Those two. 
there's no landing for that one, so I can't tell if I cleared it or not. Ah, this trail. Dude, I've gotten so much better just in today. Like, just today. I am so much faster. Speed. Slow down a little bit for this section. <laughs> okay, so there's this wall ride I didn't do last time that you probably have to get a ton of speed for. But the run out looks really bad. Oh, never mind. I saw that. Button. Oh, yeah, that's easy. Oh. Dude, that's crazy. My hands. So rattly. Now we're going to hit up Richter. Richter's pretty fun. It's super short though. I remember I used to love it last year, but I think it's actually more fun on a hardtail. Yeah, this massive paver berms. Well, not massive, maybe like five feet tall. Crossover into the techie section. All the tech trails here are amazing. Now let's step up that I never get enough speed for. Oh. oh, I cleared that one this time. Come on to that. Come on to that. And then, we're at the bottom. So now we're gonna go do this double black trail called Velocity DH into a trail called Twilight Zone, which is apparently like mostly wood and pavers. So pretty excited. First double black here. Second, third double black I've ever done. So. so right now we're heading over to Velocity, which on the map, it says it's actually a pro line. So I'm not, I'm, a, I'm half expecting, I'll full expecting to have to walk something. But right here, it also says it's a pro line. Why does it keep saying it's a pro line? All right, take it ridiculously slow. Because we've never done a pro line before. Pro line, yeah, I know. First pro line. Super loose. Okay, so we did a pro line successfully. Oh, holy moly. That was techy. This is probably one of the hardest trails. Oh my gosh, the seat. Drop! So now we're gonna go hit Twilight Zone. I had no speed to that jump because we stopped after. 
and no and no and no I cleared that one oh this part's fun yeah I'm actually clearing them Bridge. Dude, this is so nice. Oh, that's so nice. Off camber wooden thingy. Dude, that was so sick. These trails are so fun, dude. These double blacks, man. The best. Twilight zone. Oh, that's a nice jump. Oh, I cleared all those. That was so sick. So he's gonna follow Cameron. Yeah, you like it. They're going down shopping trail now. Oh yeah, big with nice berms, jumps. It was kind of long this section. Big section. We just went on Velocity, and it was pretty fun. I don't know if it was... Yeah, finally we made it across that. Yeah, but now this is my second favorite trail. I don't know why, but Mammoth Wall Rides are really fun. This burn, you can go completely burnt on it. Drop it. Burn. Jump. Oh, garden. Burn. So yeah, now we're heading over to Skid Marks, which is a double black trail that comes off the top. Apparently it's pretty exposed, so I'm excited. So Skid Marks is right up here. I'm thinking it's right here. This looks like it has browns and stuff, so assuming this is it. Oh, you can go fast. That's a foot down. This is the loosest trail I've ever been on. This 
part is pretty techy. Okay. This is a different type of trail to the rest of the stuff. This is a lot less of big hits and more. It's oh, this is just like surfing. Alright, here's a little bit more skid marks. Oh my! Here. Yeah, here's Toll Road. Here's Toll Road. Really fast. Reminds me kind of a kamikaze. <laughs> oh, that's fine. This stuff is so soft, it doesn't even hurt to crash on it. Holy cow, that was crazy. All of these trails, man, so fun. Okay, so now we're coming up on flow, which is a pro line. Should be pretty cool. So here is flow. Okay. Flow is the flowiest trail ever. Nope. Never listen to trail names. Flow is not flowy. Lesson learned. And here's Pipeline, which is a jump trail. So as it said over there, we're gonna take this one slow, first run down. We're just trying to make sure we know what we're doing. Okay, I got those a little bit. Massive wooden bridge. So right now I'm just making sure I know what I'm getting into. Okay, I'm clearing some of these now. Smooth operator, I've heard good things about this one too. Starts off with a roller, into a flat turn, into a racer jump. Yeah. Another racer jump, into a normal jump. Hey, 
Oke. Okay. Into that thing. Holy cow, did you see me? I just died on that. So right now, we're heading over to do a trail called Follow Me. This will probably be our last trail of the day. Oh yeah, this one's pretty fun so far. Avoid that tree. Whew. Oh, that was scary. <laughs> Big boy, steep rock garden. I'm gonna go pretty fast on this bit. I'm trying to make sure not to go too fast because I'm riding the trail completely blind. Type of stuff. Okay. Blind for the first time, kind of Oh! <laughs> this is a trail I definitely want to hit earlier in the day next time. This is definitely preferable for a downhill bike. <laughs> Holy moly. Oh my gosh. Hardest thing I've ever done, hands down. A uh, little break. Talk to my dad about how gnarly this trail is. Now I'll back on it. This trails were all about line choice. Oh, this part's steep. That stick hit my bash guard. the turns not in them <laughs> I went the wrong way Ah! <sighs> 
that was crazy. Now let's settle into the soothing feeling of knowing how much I progressed today.